Kids at all times, protect yourselves at all times. In case of a knockdown, go to the corner I tell you to go to, or we're gonna call you out. And most importantly, keep it clean. Touch them up. All right, I was not expecting a touching of the gloves there, to be honest with you. But here we go, guys. I'm Time excited. Main event. Your main event. <laughs> I'm freaking out right now. I cannot wait. There's been so much build up to this moment right now. How we're do you guys feel, right? Like you guys know these people. You know them through and through. What's my the heart's out of my chest right now, <laughs> honestly. You don't understand the pressure. Like there's been so much that went into this. So many different storylines. So much trash talk. We're gonna find out right now. Oh Here we go. God. Austin McBroom in the orange trim. <laughs> Fluffy Bri trim. Yeah, Bryce Hall in the red and black. Austin smiling at him early. Immediately, I like this stance of McBroom a little better. Bryce Hall said he's been sparring four to five times a week. Good left hand by McBroom. And that's the best thing these guys can do, right? It's all about experience. The more sparring, the better. Now, Austin's been used to coaching with, with other sports and everything else. Bryce Hall. Oh! oh. Austin got in trouble. All right, so McBroom a little shot there on Bryce Hall as they broke up. Bryce Hall's been in over 40 street fights. Oh! Very interesting. So he does bring a little experience to the to this ring, right? And anytime there was an influencer meetup, Bryce Hall got in a fight with another influencer. It happened so many times, I, I couldn't even tell you. Austin McBroom, a former NCAA basketball player, said his dream was to play in the NBA. Ooh, big, oh, big left hand by McBroom. Wow, which explains why Austin's footwork is looking so nice right now. Paul immediately trying to tie up. He got a point taken oh, for that. Pick him up, keep it clean, and then the fucking corner. Let's go. This ref is not All having right. the nonsense. His team needs to tell Bryce to stay composed at this time. So the referee just took a full point away from Bryce Hall. Well, it looked like he was going in there, and he's doing more of a full contact MMA type of style, right? That is not what we're doing here. Well, that's Bryce. I mean, that's... <laughs> we talk about the street fights. He wants to tackle people. This ref could stop this fight. If I hope he doesn't. I hope he doesn't. I already see blood pouring out of Bryce's nose. nose. Well, and Bryce looks scared, right? That's why he's tying up. He's getting hit really hard, and he's scared on his ear. Oh, the fear in his eyes. Another big left hand. If, if he doesn't lift, Liz and the ref stop. Hey, hey, guys, there's a million-dollar bet on the line here. They wait, bet wait. each other one million dollars. I'll be yeah. honest. I was so into that round, I didn't even look at the clock. No, I didn't, I didn't see it. Hey, bet. The knockout. The knockout. Yeah, the knockout. knockout has to happen for the million dollar bet to go down. Hey, it's looking pretty good for McBroom at this point, right? All right, so a knockout or a TKO, does that pay too? I think Ke it was Kim's interview. I believe it was in my, a knockout. Okay. A knockout in my interview. Okay, so he has to be knocked out. Okay. But if you look around, you see how the entire arena has pushed up. I mean, this is insane. The craziest thing I saw when Bryce was in this corner, Austin's team was literally yelling at him from ringside trying to get into his head when trying to make him lose his composure. Hey, it's strategy, baby. That's strategy. And here's right there that McBroom didn't like what Bryce Hall was doing. And he said, he's grabbing me. So then right after that is when Bryce had a point deducted because, that again, he would just go in and then that you cannot do. No. Not right. MMA, guys. We got to keep it clean. Again, this main event, five rounds, two-minute rounds. Bryce Hall's already had a point deducted. That first round looked like it was clearly to Austin McBroom. Yeah, so possibly that round is a 10-8 round, right, with the point being taken. No doubt. That's what I judged on the unofficial scorecard. Oh. So far, it's going the way I thought with Austin with the lead, but Bryce is a tough kid. And these two are just standing there. Big right oh, hand is right. picking up. Clearly an advantage. You know, my biggest takeaway, it looks like Austin's having fun in there. 
He no. is. No. Yeah. The speed of Austin McBroom is unreal. His footwork is amazing, and this is exactly what Bryce had to worry about coming in. This Bryce. is deep waters for all. Deep waters. Bryce should be thankful that hook did not land. Ooh. Every shot oh, is good. Oh. Straight left. Does have to pay the million. Oh, I mean, wow. So Bryce does it again. Again. And now the referee's like, I'm going to take away another one. Oh, my God. You know, these boxing commissioners, they're used to, you know, those professional high level fights. This is a no nonsense ref. Well, it's not a secret. Bryce got paid five million for this. Let's go. Come on. So if he has to pay a million, he's still up. Oh, a big straight left hand. A standing Six, eight count. Seven. Two, I'm good. I see you. And Bryce Hall saying, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Let me fight. And that's the end of the second round. But oh in the in the judge's eyes, that standing eight count had to give the round to McBrook. Absolutely, a hundred percent. And you just see how tough this guy is. I mean, he's sitting there arguing with, with everybody. They focus, Taylor. Water, water, water. Okay. They come. Listen, you got slip those hooks. He throw hooks, so you got slip them. All right, but you gotta get inside and make it a ball fight now. All right, come on. You know you can do it. Paige, what did you see here in the second round? Uh, the power shots, right? McBroom's coming with with tons of punches. He has way more power, and he's utilizing oh. his weight, right? He's putting his weight behind every punch. Mm -hmm. He's got more power. He's got more quickness. Foos, what do you see? Man, I see Austin taking control right now, and I see Bryce losing his composure little by little. You're starting to see the blood coming out of the nose of Bryce Hall as we head into round number three. So far, Bryce has a chin. He can take a punch. Now, if those ounces were different, I don't know if it would be the same story. Yeah, that's right. If those, if those Ooh, gloves were smaller. Okay. Bryce starting off strong with that body shot, head shot. Austin coming back, clinched up. Oh, he is throwing from left field. Ooh, now, a problem there, right? A little mistake on McBroom's part. Just because you're tied up, you can still punch there. Until the ref separates you, it's still live action. It looks like Bryce has turned the gas on. I, I, you know, it's that fight or flight response, right? He realizes he's in trouble and he needs to turn it up if he wants any chance to yeah, win this fight. He's reacting to what's being thrown at him right now. He's not trying to control the narrative at all at this point. McBroom, if, if he would put punches together and not keep throwing these wannabe knockout shots, he would finish it. He would get the knockout he's looking for, but you got to set it up. Ooh. McBroom really looks like he's enjoying himself <laughs> thus far. Oh, he's got to be. Once you smell blood, then you just feel, feel what it feels like to be a fighter. We are more than halfway through the scheduled five rounds. You know, earlier we talked about how nobody wants to fight Taylor Holder. Well, it is the exact opposite. Oh! Considered a smoker fight, right? That was a good 
good stuff. He was taking a lot of damage. A lot of damage. There can't be too much debate. Clearly, Austin was going to get the knockout. It wasn't going to change. The direction of this fight was That's not, not going to change. But when you got a million dollars on the table, maybe you give him one more. I don't know. I'm, but I'm interested to see what Bryce has to say right now because I saw when it was stopped, he looked really angry. Yes. Oh, yeah. Does he go into this with fighting words or does he take his loss? Oh, he's going to lose his mind. This guy, this guy's going to be very angry. This is going to get very heated in this interview. All right, I want to go quickly and take a look at the final punch stats presented by Stat Hero Survive the Game. And it's very, very one sided.